Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and today, this is like the third video on these puzzles, but I thought it'd be pretty cool if you were designing something and you just wanted a different font and you could use it for a kid's name. I just wrote out the word puzzle. There's two ways to do it, and this way doesn't work, and I'll explain it in just a second. So I've taken the word puzzle, but I broke the letters apart. And if you don't know how to do that, you just type out a letter. And those letters are connected. Just go up to object and break text apart. And then each one of these letters are individual. So anyway, I broke them apart. I'm going to click on my object. I'm going to go up to the puzzle maker. I'm going to create. Now at this time... I'm going to change those lines not to a hairline so but to a raster or engrave line and this is a little bit different than the one I did a while ago but then you while you're on your item power clip well let's do this make a duplicate of your letter of your puzzle click on your item power clip place inside frame now maybe on this one, uh, turn it upside down. Power clip, place in front side frame. Gives you a little bit different look maybe. Maybe even turn this one, let's turn this one 45 degrees. And you wouldn't have to do this, but just to give you a different look. There you go, and just do that to the last one. Now, each individual letters were done one at a time. This one, I powered clip a long puzzle, you know, like that size, into this. Well, it doesn't work because it will not allow me to change those red lines to, to not cut lines. Anyway, hope this helped a little bit, and thank you for watching. That'd be a pretty neat font.